I'm trying not to be super cheesy in this video, but I might not be able to help myself. Hi, and welcome back to Monday Motivation, the video series to help you kickstart your week with energy and inspiration. I'm April Bowles Olin, and today we're going to talk about a can-do attitude. A can-do attitude is really important. If you are running your own business and you're trying to build your own business and you approach things with a attitude or you let a challenge get in your way, you are going to struggle so much. You should approach things with a mindset that a challenge is exciting, that you enjoy challenges, that it's okay and approach things knowing that there are going to be challenges. If you expect everything to go smoothly, you are going to be so disappointed. Let me give you an example. A few weeks ago, I was working on a blog post and I was running into technical challenge after technical challenge, which usually doesn't happen. I don't usually run across a bunch of challenges. However, <laughs> That day I was, and I'd written the rough draft, I'd already gone over it once, but I was in there finalizing it and making edits and all of that kind of good stuff, and I spent about an hour making edits to the blog post, and Microsoft Word crashed. Dun dun dun, lost all my edits. So I had to redo it. Was that gonna keep me from publishing my blog post that day? Mm -mm. Heck no. No way am I going to let that stop me. Then I was hooking up Aweber and lead pages together because I was putting together a downloadable PDF for that blog post. In order to access that PDF, readers needed to insert their name and email address to get it, to get the download. And lead pages was not working with Aweber for some reason. I had to get on with lead pages support and they gave me a bunch of different options, tried every one of them, none of them worked. Lead Pages was amazing. They then helped me, they went into Aweber themselves and fixed whatever was going on and were able to help me. So thank you so much Lead Pages for working with me that day. But that took about another extra hour that I wasn't expecting. And then I was also having another issue just with my blog that I was having to deal with my hosting company with. And that took about 30 minutes, maybe a little bit longer. So all of this added time could have made me go, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'll just wait until next week. Forget about it. Instead, I had a can-do attitude and thought, Everything isn't going to run smoothly every single time I go to publish a blog post. Am I going to let that stand in my way? Or am I going to be consistent and publish every Wednesday like I say I'm going to? I'm going to be consistent and publish every Wednesday like I say I'm going to. Another thing to keep in mind with this whole can-do attitude topic is that everything is figure outable. That is a term coined by Marie Forleo and I loved it when I first heard it and I've heard her say it multiple times since then but really and truly everything is figure outable. Go Marie for coming up with a really cool way of saying that. If you are struggling with something google it. Do a little research. How many times do I get emails from people asking me something that they could have easily googled and gotten the answer to? Every single day, not joking, every day I get an email from at least one person asking me something that they could have Googled and gotten the answer themselves. What is happening to our world, people? Let's remain positive. I want to suggest to you for this week, every time you find yourself running into a challenge, look at it as a positive. Look at it as a way to grow, to learn something new, to figure it out. Look at it as that's life. It's going to happen. Challenges are going to come up, but are you going to let them be your excuses for not succeeding? You tell me right now. Are you going to let challenges be the excuse that you don't create the life that you want and the life that you love and a business you love? Heck no, not happening. That's what I got for you this week. Try to approach everything with a can-do attitude and see what it does for you. And don't let your challenges become excuses. I'm April Bulls Olin from Blacksburg Bell, and I will see you again next week with another episode of Monday Motivation. No, 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 no. <sighs> All right. Stop it.